hello friends welcome to my channel and this video deals about a problem on Morse test and let me see the question during a trial run on a six cylinder petrol engine a Morse test was carried out as a means of estimating the indicated power of the engine the brake power output was 60 kilowatt running at full load and all cylinders working the measured brake output when each cylinder was cut out in in turn and the load reduced to bring the engine back to its original speed are as follows cylinder cut first first one and brake power is 42.5 second one is 41.6 and third cylinder is 41.8 4th cylinder is 42 and 5th cylinder is 42.4 6th cylinder is 41.9 and from the above data determine the indicated power of the engine the mechanical efficiency and now we will see the solution the indicated power the indicated power of the engine that is IP1 is equal to BP minus BP1 that is equal to 60 minus 42.5 that is equal to 17.5 kilowatt IP2 is equal to BP minus BP2 that is equal to 60 minus 41.6 that is 18.4 kilowatt IP3 is equal to BP minus BP3 that is equal to 60 minus 41 point Eight, that is 18.2 kilowatt and now IP4 that is equal to 60 minus 42 18 kilowatt IP5 
60 minus 42.4 that is 17.6 kilowatt IP6 is 60 minus 41.9 that is equal to 18.1 kilowatt and now total IP that is equal to IP1 plus IP2 IP3 plus IP4 IP5 IP6 that is 17.5 18.4 plus 18 plus 17.6 plus 18.1 that will be 107.8 kilowatt and now we will see the mechanical efficiency mechanical efficiency eta m that is equal to bp by ip that is equal to 60 by 107.8 that will be equal to 0. 5566 that is 0 0.5566 divided by 100 that is 55.66 percent Thank you for watching and if you like this video please like please share and subscribe